Okay, I'm gonna have to hold you there because my camera. Oh no, it's now it's stuck. <laughs> Is um not meant to play ball there. Hi everyone, welcome back to another vlog. This vlog is beginning in the car because we are actually, well I am off to HomeSense with Alanya and I've never been, I've never been to HomeSense and I'm so excited. I've wanted to go to HomeSense for years. I can't actually tell you why I've never been to HomeSense. I've just never, I've never, I've never gone. There's not one local to us, so we're gonna have a little drive out. I'm gonna go pick her up now. Uh, we're gonna get Starbucks, and then yeah, we're gonna have a little wander around Home Sense. I've not gone in with a list of like I want this, I want that, I want this because I don't know what I want. I don't know what to expect. I kind of want those glasses that you can get from Anthropology with like all the fruits and everything around the sides because I want some like cute little drinking glasses, but. I want I don't want to pay anthropology price so <laughs> I'm kind of hoping that we've got like a little home sense dupe going on but I'll just see what takes my fancy it's also payday so me and Alanya are buzzing with our payday except we both have houses that we both renovated so we're both skint at the same time but um she's just come back from Florida as well with her fella so she's she's feeling the payday um but yeah, let's go get it. I'm wearing my new Boohoo jumper and my jeans and my little Zara bag. Got my trench coat and my Ugg dupes on from Ego. And yeah, we're ready for the day. Super excited. But I hope you're all doing okay. And yeah, let's go to Home Set. <laughs> Look at mushroom. Oh, God. Would you like a good mushroom? <gasps> All the Halloween bits. Oh, quick! Why are you like looking from the outside? Quick, can it? Oh, this I actually really need baskets. I don't know what for, but I need them. But we've just picked up one of these, and it smells really nice. What you want? Storage. One that's like a picnic basket. Storage. But yeah, I'm half debating this pink pumpkin. Look at look at that! Look at that! It's good cool, actually. That. Oh look, cute little Labrador. Cuties, cute, 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 cute. No, it does. Is there? Oh, it's not focusing. Why is it doing? Come do it! it. Come, on. Come on! Did I press anything? No, <laughs> it's not moving. That was going to be my whole little thing. Where do you you press it and it's not moving? Your basket's so much better than mine. Yeah, because I spend money every time I will come out with you and I'll come out with you anymore. No, I'm not being friends with you anymore. Our friendship is done. It's done, because you make me spend stuff. To be fair, I would get that like, coffee table if I knew how much it was. The reason that me and Bob aren't together anymore. Oh, it's so alright, you can, um, we'll, we'll break up with our boyfriends <laughs> and move in with each other. I said that to my mum last night, I want to live with a girl and do it all cute, like, cute, happy cute styles vibe house. Yeah. That table, you will start with that table. <laughs> Good morning, I've decided we're having breakfast in bed this morning which is just strawberry jam on a bagel thin um my spot is completely flat but it's a bit red and the rest of them are clearing up hopefully but Rue's also brought one of her stinky toys in bed with her she's got this party trick going on at the minute that if she gets too hot in the night with a jumper on she'll take it off herself and then she looks like a naked baby when she wakes up, because the jumper's just wherever on the bed, and there she is, just like little naked baby. Then we've also got my iced coffee, my cranberry juice, and then my current queue on my phone on Ticketmaster, which isn't looking good for Coldplay. 2025 Coldplay, and I'm in that current position, and at half nine, they said. Extremely limited availability. Then why keep me in the queue? Just put me on my misery and take me off it. But yeah, the plan is today. I'm gonna go to the gym in a bit. I need to show you what I got from Home Sense because that was a fun day. And then, yeah, I might just have a little pot around. I cleaned up all yesterday so I can finally light. We got the new candles from home sense which I'll show you in a bit but I felt like I couldn't light them until the whole house was clean 
I feel like I should do it on this side because there's no spots on this side. It's like before and after. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know why my skin's breaking out so bad recently. I do think it is because I've disrupted my skin barrier. So I think this side's healing quite well. Hello. Is it because mum's got breakfast? And then this side's kind of like, I'm just going to take my time, you know, you hurt my skin barrier, so... I'm not going to do it again. No. Okay. <laughs> what, what were we saying? Yeah, we got some new candles from Home Sense, but I couldn't light them until the whole house was clean. So yesterday, I decided to do a six mile run, which went really well actually. And then I decided to come home and clean the... In entire house I am not a climbing frame um, which wasn't a, the best idea because I, I felt faint I wanted to be sick I was like because <laughs> normally 5k is my limit 3 miles is my limit I pushed myself to 6 god knows why um, and yeah I decided to do a full house clean so I could finally light my candles which smelled amazing and yeah, then we chilled out for the rest of the night. And yeah, today's just like pottering about, doing bits and pieces. Slip back bun is done. Looks like shit, will forever look like shit because as long as I've got my nanos in, the beads will always be popping through. I'm also thinking there's another friend. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna say friend, I'm gonna say enemy now. There's one there that I've just put a little sticker on and then there's one here that I'm going to put a sticker on as well. I've got no idea why they keep thriving, thriving through, I can't speak. Okay, I do think it might be my new Skin In Me cream. Oh fuck. Because it's only since I've started using this that I'm having these breakouts. So, but I'm not entirely sure because my last one did have retinol in it, but this one's saying that it doesn't have retinol in it and I've not been using retinol, so I don't know. We'll see. If it keeps on happening, I might have to um, do another, oh God, with a bit of cream, do another consultation and just say, look, it's breaking me out. Um, but it also might be the purge part of the cream. I don't know. I don't know but I'm gonna put my headphones on now I'm gonna take Rue out for a walk and then yeah I need to pop to the pharmacy and pick up my prescriptions and yeah see see what we're up to with the day I'm feeling a bit cheeky I'm feeling a bit I might have to put some concealer on these spots before I go for a walk um yeah I'm feeling a bit reckless with the house considering the paint air comes on Monday by the time this vlog goes up, the painter would have started in the house. And I've already base coated the horse there's and landing. So I'm thinking on Monday, he's probably just going to base coat and then go off and mix our paint samples that we want. So I don't think there's going to be much drastic changes, but I'm hoping soon. But I popped on my new Sheen leggings. And I absolutely love these leggings. Like considering they're from Sheen and they weren't that expensive. I think they were like £8. They're really tight, really, really sculptured, really structured, you know, I'm showing you really well here. Like, proper, proper leggings. Um, I popped on my little Nova jumper and my grey trainers and we're feeling all sporty, you know, repping our spots. I'm just going to pop some concealer on dead quick. I've also washed my makeup brushes when I was going through my house clean yesterday because I was thinking, like, is it because of my makeup brushes? I'm not too sure, but it needs to stop. I might just ask the skin in me person and just say, like, is it normal? I don't know. But then I'll show you why I'm feeling a little bit reckless when it comes to the house today. Okay, I feel like that's just a little bit better. Like, just the tiniest bit of concealer just on the redness, and I feel like my face just looks a bit more... Like, I feel better in myself... We're going out and about in the world right now. <laughs> um, I've just realised it's Friday, so the pharmacy's probably going to be closing very soon. But I'll go. I'll go next week and get all my stuff, and then I'll show you my home sent stuff after I took Rue out, and then 
yeah, I'll show you what I want to do with the house. Okay, you're on a slant. You're on a slant. This coffee is super, super required right now. Love heart straw to feel all the love. Um, yeah, I took her out for a walk. I went to go pick up my prescriptions and only half the prescription was in there. So now I've got to go back next week and request it again. Um, and then I thought, right, I'll nip to Tesco while I'm here because we're going to our friend's house on Saturday night, so tomorrow night, for some drinks, um, some food, some snacks and things like that because they just had their newborn. So we thought that like, we'll, 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 get, we'll get together, it'll be cute. So just bought the snacks and the drinks for that. And then I went to fill up my car with petrol as well, so I'm super organised. And yeah, I've got both maidens are full. Some washings out on the line. I've got washing in the washing machine that's nearly done. And that's a bedding set as well, so that's massive. I need to do my ironing. I kind of wanted to chill out at some point today, you know, like hence why I didn't go to the gym. The real reason why I didn't go to the gym was I was meant to go, but none of my gym tops were dry on the maiden and none of them were in my drawer. So I took it as a sign from the universe not to go to the gym. I still need to wash my hair at some point and I'm up at six tomorrow morning for the gym. Yeah. And I've just come back and I've just I needed to empty the dishwasher, I needed to empty the bin. Um what else did I need to do? And I just generally put stuff away, I was like uh, oh, I needed to charge the ring doorbell. You know, like, there's just like bits and pieces that you're like, it's getting a bit bitty, but the bits are making a massive piece. Um, so yeah, I'll make this coffee now. I'm having a, a second iced coffee of the day. And then I'll do my ironing, and I think I'll watch the other episode of um, Only Murders in the Building. And then, because I finished... Uh, Secret Lives of Mormon Wives which was really good I'm really excited for season 2 of that if they ever make it they kind of have to because they left it on a cliffhanger and then yeah what else am I doing yeah wash my hair at some point I kind of wanted my house task of the day was I wanted to sand down these two doors only lightly the living room one and the kitchen one coat them in the primer and then start painting them black because these are the only two doors that we're keeping down here and then we've got all the original doors in the living room currently that we're gonna that are gonna be fitted upstairs at some point so i thought well these two down here could black because they're a little bit wrecked from the renovation so yeah yeah but anyway let's crack on with the ironing because that's fun I've um, got my coffee stuff here. Oh yeah, from the shops I've got, I wanted to try this for a while. It's the Fever Tree Mojito Mixer. And then I also got a bottle of rum to go with it. Apparently you just need the rum and then you just pour this in with it. And it makes, yeah, apparently it makes your mojito. So we'll see. Uh, there is only four of us. There's me, James, Becky and I'm sure there's more heads out of it. Me, James, Becky and Maka, so there's only four of us. The baby is still on milk and she's only like eight weeks old, so she, you know, she's not on the food. We've got caramel noodles, M&M's, um, kettle crisps, Thai sweet chilli sensations, and then I've also bought a box of cocktails as well. So between our drinks, their drinks, our snacks, their snacks, and then obviously whatever we're having for blah, 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 whatever we're having for tea as well i think we should be fine right let me do a bit of ironing like, before i forget the bits that i got from home scents are i got a set of these really cute like check towels so i've got two big towels and then i've got a hand towel but they go like beige on the inside and then black on the outside which i thought these are really cute i got this sweet jar like this little pumpkin head comes off oh, I'm using my weak wrist but I thought like that'll be something and I went a bit morbid that'll be something that our kids like fight over you know when me and James die like that'll be something that the kids would be like no I want the jar like the sweet jar and I'm like that would mum always put that out for like Halloween time like this will be that jar <laughs> and then I've never actually had any of the sand and fog candles but this is the vanilla pumpkin one with the 
really cute lid and it does smell amazing. I was going to try and let you smell it then, but obviously you can't. And then I got this little Ruzi's treat jar with all of Ruzi's treats in it. And she sort of, she's clocked that already, but I have to put it on this counter because Madam, yes you, is now jumping on this counter to get to stuff around here. And also when we're coming in through the front door, she jumps on here. So if I put it on that one, she can't reach it. Um, I also got this um, marble, I'm calling it a masher, but James said there's a proper term for it. But you can see we've already used it and it does die really easily. And I thought it would be a bit like upsetting for me, but it's not. It's just like it's used and it's loved and James has wanted one for a while. So basically we put all of our herbs and spices that we want to use in one of these and we grind it all together. It's like a fine thing. And then, yeah, you create your own seasoning. So that's really good. I got another candle. This one's called Library, but um, it smells really nice and I love the little topper on it. I'm trying to think, did I get anything else? I'm trying to think. I don't think I did. I think they, they were the only bits and pieces that I bought, but I'm super happy with my purchase. I could have brought, could have brought, I could have bought a lot more, but I had to rein myself in and think you can get all this really cute, fun stuff, more of it when the house is done, which I'm kind of hoping I should be able to get the flooring and the radiators down by November. Well, November time-ish. Alexa, turn off bedroom lamps. Okay. So, it's um, a little bit later in the evening now. James is home from work. Woo, a uh, light change. Um, I've washed my hair and I've done my hair care and my skincare. Dots for spots on, of course. They're actually starting to flatten off, thankfully. So, I just need this redness to go from all the other spots and I should be okay. But, um... I've sent an email to that skin and me as well, just like explaining that. I'm breaking out a lot, I don't know if it's the cream. Can someone just, oh my Lord. Can someone just maybe like review my prescription for my cream and just see. Um, but James is making tea. Ooh. And yeah. He's also topped up our washer fluid in our car because it was a little, um, a bitty job day. All the little jobs just needed doing all at once. I feel like you're cooking up a storm. What is going on? I mean, you know, that doesn't help for tomorrow. But... Yeah, and then we're going to watch the new season of Brassic as well because that's out. James is a massive um, scary film, horror film person, and I'm not a massive one, but I like to watch them September, October time. Nope. And I get four a year, and I've used none so far. <laughs> you just get scared, doesn't he, Ru? Hi everybody. Should we give you your tea? Hmm? I feel like there's some kind of favouritism. I've got steak, rice and broccoli. Which what you asked for. Yeah, but I didn't know that chorizo and peppers was on the table. Neither did I until I got down here. And you're having steak. Oh, look at that. Peppers, chorizo and pasta. Look at that. I feel like I've been a... Uh, been a bit short changed here so hot. hot good morning it's now sunday we're just up and ready to leave because we're gonna go to see james's mum and dad first they've just come back from greece and i've not seen them for ages so we're gonna go see them make sure they had a good holiday plus they've got the dog currently because james dropped the dog off yesterday because we were both in work and then, yeah, we went to our friend's house last night, had some drinks, had some pizza, saw the baby. And then, yeah, today we're going to Holly's Farm Shop. Um, I think there's two shops, but I know one's 
in Cheshire, so we're going to go to that one. I think there's two, but I don't know where the second one is, if there is a second one. So, yeah, the plan is... Oh, James is hoovering. Yeah, the plan is that we're going to nip to James's mum's first, and then we're going to go to Holly's Farm Shop. Never been. I'm really excited. This week's just been full of new shops that I've wanted to go to. I've always wanted to go to Home Sense. Me and my friend went on Wednesday. I've always wanted to go to Holly's Farm Shop. Me and James are going today. So I've got my new PLT cardigan on, which is great. It's got little shoulder pads in it. I've got a little black tee underneath just for layers. I've got my ASOS jeans, my new balances, and then I'm going to go with my trench coat and my black Zara bag. I'm going to quickly grab a coffee and then we'll get going to Holly's Farm Shop. Quick, um... I'm saying pit stop, we're down, well I'm downstairs in the kitchen living room area because I just realised that James won't be ready at all because he's gone to the food shop. So he's getting ready now. I'm just going to enjoy some pan au chocolates and an iced vanilla latte and watch another little bit of Stranger Things because the next season's coming out next year. So I'm on season three, just so I can remind myself, fully catch up. And then we'll go get the dog, bring her back here, say hi to James' mum and dad. And then we will go to Holly's farm shop. They're cute then. Come on, you gotta get that. They're cute. <laughs> Wildly busy in here. What have you found? What have you saw? Beer. <laughs> no, what type of Jeremy beer? Jeremy Clarkson's beer. It's good. But I have heard good things about Whispering Angel, but there's no point in getting it now. We just got one of these little cuties. This is what our house is going to be like next year, you know, and I said I'll go all out. What? For the, for the decorating. Should we get um, bacon in a bottle? What is it? You just put it all in, that's the mixture. Oh. Yes, that's all you mix it, you need to bake. Oh, they got the bigger ones. Mm. See, that's your mixtures for baking. So if you want to make like custard creams, that's your mixture. Bondi mix. Cookie slab mix. So that's all your mixture, and it gives you the recipes. Good out there. Can I show them what we got? Yep. We've got the triple chocolate brownies. Got the face mask. No, that's from <laughs> We've got the bread rolls. For them. We've got some really got nice some cheese. for tonight. We're gonna try the cheese now though. Oh are we? Yeah. Cheese test. Mm. We've got James's mum some lemon drizzle cakes the other dog last night. James Scott is Jeremy Clarkson beers. And, I'll, and your cider, actually. I'll try a bit of your cider, but I won't have the full thing. Oh, I'm also got some scones. You got, use some scones. Do you like scones? I don't like the... That's twice to do that with the toaster, now the, the not, prunes. Almost like I'm joking. They're not prunes, they're, they're It's almost like you're doing it on purpose. And then we got some cakes for after our burgers tonight as well. We got... You got a lemon cheesecake and I got a white chocolate fudge cheesecake. Which looks nice. You just took a bite of the cheese. No. There you go. Mm. I do have a good tasting cheese. Do you want to eat all the cheese for the burger tonight, please? I do want to try and grab it. And then we'll go let the dog. Try this at brown. Yeah. I'll have a bit of yours. Correct. Right. So that bitch. <laughs> That's what you got for the cheese. Mm. Oh my damn. Ten 
Not bad. And they're a bit rich. Mm -mm. Never buy me a birthday cake. Just buy a pack of these and stick a candle on it. I'm not waiting 40 minutes for. <laughs> oh. Our little ghost guy. Got a little ghost guy. Which um. I love the farm shop, I've never been in the farm shop, but that actual shop shop. It might be different midweek, but for me, I got a bit claustrophobic and I almost stopped him yeah, and taking sad. pictures and I was just a bit like, move please. No, the, 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 where we got all the food in the house, we got like... You're going ghost guy. Right. I need a wee as well. And then we'll go get the dog. You first. And then watch films. Okay, James has just shouted me down for tea, but I've just washed my face, so we're gonna quickly do my skincare with my hyaluronic acid. I don't think I told you, I've just popped that spot. Please don't copy what I do because that is very naughty. Um Yeah, I um, don't think I told you I emailed the skin and me dermatologist and she got back to me like within 24 hours actually which is really good and she said that the reason why i'm coming out in so many spots is because my skin's going through this purging phase which i think i did last year or the year before when i started using retinol and then i got into a good routine of it and then i went on holiday and I got out of the routine of using retinol. So my skin's going back through a purging process because apparently um, this has got tretinoin, tretinoin in, which is apparently is like retinol um, and it goes through a purging process. So she said basically it's just getting rid of all like my blocked pores which can sometimes cause breakouts so yeah basically i'm just in a sit and wait process now i don't think i'm getting any new ones besides that one which is good because normally i'm getting about three new spots a day and now i've only got one so touch wood you know things are getting better in terms of my purging phase then she basically said that the up the dose of this tre tre annoying or something very little each month so your skin builds like a barrier and resistance against like blockages and things but yeah she's going to keep it at this level for now um and then let my skin build up some resistance before increasing it again but i just thought it was really good like you pay Something like twenty four ninety nine or something a month. Um, but literally I emailed a dermatologist and within twenty four hours she got back to me, she told me what we're gonna do next to try and fix it and everything else. So for like what you get, like the personalised cream to like for your skin, I think it's quite good, really, but yeah, I'm going through a purging process at the minute. All these are flat. These are flat besides that one. These are now all flat as well. And these two are going down. And that one's flat as well. <laughs> so I'm kind of hoping, one, there's no more space for spots to go. And two, I'm kind of hoping I'm coming to the end of my little purging phase. But I'm still going to put on a few dots for spots. And then we're going to go downstairs. I don't know what film planning on watching the new brassic is out actually so we might watch a bit of brassic and then james has just cooked our burgers for us and then i think we're gonna have our cheesecakes for dessert which we've been very naughty this weekend but hey ho hey ho right let us go down and have our tea but it's been a lovely day we've just got the dog back from James's mum and dad and we bought them some lemon drizzle cake to say thank you but let's go and have burgers. Ooh. Ooh. Looks nice. You touch Bite marks. You touch <laughs> but is it nice? Very excited. Whoop. 
because it was in the little butcher's section. To be fair, all that meat in that little butcher's section was really good. They had like, finish your little um, meat cut off bits. It's like steaks and things look nice. On the cheese that we got. Good soup. Mm. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Let's start getting our meat from the butchers. Yeah. I will. I would. Can I just put a face in? Yeah. Good morning. In our little um, ghost guy, chilling. Let's stick that candle on in a bit so we can have our cheesecakes without smelling like burgers. <laughs> what do you want to watch tonight? The cute background in with the candle and the new little ghosty guy. And me. Look at him. Any cute. Cute, cute, cute. Oh crap. Right. I have. I have a lemon cheesecake. Is it lemon? Yeah. yeah. I asked for lemon. And then I got the white chocolate fudge cheesecake. Is it cheesecake? Well, it's a cookie pie, but it looks like a cheesecake to me. Right, okay. Yeah, it's cheesy, isn't it? Mm. Nice. Mm. And you've got, a, nice. you've got a coffee? Yes. And I don't know what we're going to watch, but it's not golf. We're watching golf in our ambiance. End of September weekend. Okay. Love my new little ghost guy. We need the names for the ghosts. Why? Because he's cute. He deserves a name. Oh, and then we'll stick something on. What should we watch? I'll leave this one if you want. I'm not leaving golf on. Is it nice though, or is it not what you expected? Okay. I've got like a white chocolate hard bit on top. Like a creme brulee. But for white chocolate. Mm. We finished Lyle and Eric Menendez yeah. brothers. It's really good. I do believe that they were sexually assaulted. I do. It's very like have they haven't they? But I do believe them. After researching a lot, I think we lost as well. I do think we should be let out now. Yeah. I think they've done the time. I'd like to see it go to trial again. Can you go back to trial if you're already yeah. being sentenced, can you? Right, my lovelies, we've gone to bed now. I'm saying we. You're comfy now. Not yet? Are we comfy? Okay. Um, we ended up watching the clocks in the wall or like the 
ticking clock in the wall or something like that with Jack Black on Netflix which was actually kind of like it wasn't amazing it was mainly like a kids Halloween film but it was quite cozy because it was raining outside we had our cakes and we were watching like a little kids Halloween film so it was quite cute Um James is now playing FIFA downstairs because FIFA's come out so I said I'll come upstairs I need to I did this vlog because it's Sunday night and I am up early for work so I'm gonna leave this vlog here but I hope you're all doing okay and I hope you had a nice autumnal week yourself or about to have a nice autumnal week and if you got to the end of this vlog thank you very much I really appreciate you and I am super excited to crack on with more awesome decorating the decorator is coming this week actually because this vlog's going up tomorrow and he's meant to be starting tomorrow but apparently he's um he's run late and behind sorry i'm just setting up stranger things um he's run late and behind on his last job so he's now starting on wednesday problem being is if he does wednesday thursday friday he's got the living room the front bedroom and the hall stairs and landing to do you can't come next week monday tuesday wednesday ideally or thursday because i'm on nights unless he wants to do thursday afternoon friday you might want to work on the weekend as well we'll just see but i'm on nights unfortunately so that that's a no-go until i'm done with nights but I'm off again the week after on annual leave because I didn't realise I've booked annual leave three weeks within each other, but it's fine. And then we're off to York that week as well, actually. So, yeah, I hope you're all doing okay and I will see you all very soon. Bye, guys.